Hey guys, it's Obazan here, and as you can see, we are playing a game of War Thunder. We are actually going to show you just here, this little button here. It says arcade battles, tank arcade battles, aerialistic battles, tank realistic battles, simulator, squadron, and event and tournaments, custom battles. Well, I've said that I'm going to do one of these things down here, simulated battles and aerialistic, and maybe tank realistic battles. But I think we're going to jump straight into the air arcade battles first. And then we're going to do the tank battles all in one video. So let's see how that goes out. And that joined ridiculously quickly. So we just have to wait for the loading screen. The loading screen is a bit that always lags. So I think I've got this working at 60 FPS. Hopefully, fingers crossed, recording at 60 FPS. Because the software has just been recently updated that I used to record. And they said that they fixed so many problems with Windows 10. So we're going to jump in with this one, which I think is a reasonably good plane, but it's not so good. So we're going to fly with this one. See how good this one is. Right. So the idea is to take out basically all the ground troops. Obviously, we're going to have planes stopping us, which are the enemy team. There's other players on this game. Unfortunately, they haven't got the bit where people can be in tanks and people can be in planes in this game unless you're in the tank battles but then there's only like three planes anyway so yeah that bit's confusing but we're going to try and take out these tanks down here which are all computer controlled I'm going to slow our plane right down first one I want to turn my sensitivity mouse on the mouse down as well Okay, okay, we're doing some damage here. We might need to turn around here as well. So the easiest way to do that, I think, is possibly just doing that. Apparently that's not the easiest way, but... Okay. So we're going to take out these targets just here by slowing down the plane. As you can see. Okay. Three ground targets. That's four targets for me now. I've just taken down. See if we can take out any over here. Oh wait, some just here. Okay, they really are targeted. Oh really? I crashed into the tank. <laughs> well, luckily we've got another four planes to dr to drive to fly. Yeah, we got there in the end. We've got four plane, planes to fly. I need to sort out this jumper as well. This jumper is an absolute nightmare. Okay, so. I want to try and head... Yeah, which way do we want to go? <laughs> Let's go up a little bit higher. It's really cloudy as well. That's strange. Mac play for free. Okay. Strange name. So... I, I was thinking about playing the simulator one. I had a little mess around on it. I can tell you what, it is one of the most difficult... Oh, I want to get some hits on that then. It's one of the most difficult ones that I've ever played because you can't actually see any of the planes like you can in arcade. You literally have to be in the cockpit. Okay, I think I've done some damage to him. Whoa, 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 whoa. Who's flying into me? So I think I can take out a plane while this plane's down. Ah. Uh, yes, yeah, my left wing. The plane's probably going to explode. Okay, okay. We've got a hole in my left wing, but we're still flying. The engine's still running, apparently. Nope. We are actually down. We have now crashed. I really need to turn down the volume on this as well. The propeller broke. Propeller broke. Yes, because that's exactly what happens. Can we join again? Oh, now we're in the clouds. Because apparently that's what we do in this game. You know what? We're going to try and pick, pick up as much speed as possible by falling. If that's possible. Look at that, we come out of the clouds, that's so cool. How realistic is that? So you see that little target just underneath my plane? That is in fact the bombs that I've got underneath my plane, as you can see just there, and I'm using a mouse and keyboard to 
control this plane by the way so bear in mind that space bar releases the bombs so what we're going to do is see if we can there's no way on this planet that we can hit that from here no way what we're going to do is fly basically over to here and we're going to do a bomb run see if we can take out all of these targets unlikely but we're going to give it a go see if we can do this now come on so where that target is which is just here so release now that should be a hit okay okay oh that was a bit too early so the bombs reload as well Look at that, it's so cool. Like, the guy in the back's actually shooting for me. Oh my god. I've got a leak, and I'm now going to leave my aircraft. So, you hold down J on the keyboard to actually leave the aircraft quicker. Where the hell did the tail of my plane go? <laughs> That's amazing. The actual tail just completely disintegrated. Reminds me of Indiana Jones when his dad shoots the back of the plane. I do think that's hilarious, that scene. Look at that, we've got another two planes to go until the round's over. I'm trying to take out as many ground targets as possible, or at least weaken them so team members can take them out, because then we can win the battle. So, why did the plane start steering straight away then? There we go. Yeah, in simulator and in uh, realistic battles, if you go down like this really fast, you see where it says overload? It starts saying reduce speed and so on. It probably say reduce speed, it hasn't said reduce speed yet, but usually it says reduce speed if you go too fast in real life you would have to do that otherwise you would just black out because the g-force would be way too much for you is that my plane? no it's not it's just someone's plane just sitting there okay so we got to take out these whoa okay so we just take it out two planes just there triple strike there we go Right, we've got to take out another three targets. That's easy. Come on. There's two just there. I just stalled my plane. As you do. There's one. We've got two targets left. And my plane is flying ridiculously low. It's literally got no power on it. plane is now bouncing. Oh no. Mission, mission failed? Are you kidding me? Well, that is unfortunate. That's eight minutes into the game. Did I just come top of the leaderboard? That's mad. I, I just came top of the leaderboard. Look, top of the leaderboard. Three deaths, 12 ground targets destroyed. Oh, so my team didn't actually destroy many ground targets. Great. The other team did. They destroyed a lot of ground targets. But I didn't do any bombs. Uh, what was that one? Enemy kill assist. Eh. Air targets destroyed. I didn't destroy any air targets, unfortunately. <laughs> Never mind. So we're going to jump into the tank battle now. Oh, now I've got research stuff. Let's research the airframe. We've got no points available. That's fine. Research. Uh, now we'll go to tank battles. So now we got a tank. Should be coming up. Tank battles. Hello. Select one of the loud vehicles. Ah, oh, yeah, you had to change it to army. Which had now changed me to a little DD tank. Yay! So I've got a few technical problems. As you can see, yeah, the textures go really weird here. In game, it's perfectly fine. But we're going to go to battle in tanks. So, this is joining so quickly. Conquest Poland. This should be an interesting battle. So as you can see, we're now in the uh, tank battle. I only have two tanks, unfortunately, because I haven't really got into the tank battles. I prefer the flying side of it. But we're going to see if the tank battles work. And I don't think this has been fixed. But we're going to give it a go. Nope, hasn't been fixed. There's a glitch where if I zoom in like that, 
Yeah, I can't see anything, so I have to zoom in like this to be able to hit anything. It's a nightmare, but I'm going to fix that eventually. I've tried fixing it so far, and I haven't got very far with it. Yeah, it's annoying. Very annoying, indeed. But we're going to try to play like pros. <laughs> so it's Poland versus Germany. Something like that. The Soviet Russians or something. Sorry, this is in Poland. It's meant to be. Huh. There's someone over there already? Usually there's people down there. Or in that vicinity. Usually down that area. So we're going to try and capture this point A just here. The only one we're meant to capture at the moment. And of course, you can drive through obstacles. I repeat, you can drive through obstacles. <laughs> so good. So good. You, you can drive through certain things. That's not too bad. Look, I just drove through a wall. I did just drive through a wall. Huh. Oh. Is there anyone around here? No. We can't apparently drive through this wall. Can you stop driving into it, please? Whoa. Seriously? It's on green. There we go, we hit. And then I just get taken out. Well. There you go. Wow, that travelled a long way. It killed all three of my people. Wow, that's a very strong gun. What is that? That tank looks mental. Well, we got one more tank left. And then we're probably going to have to cool it there. Fortunately, I can't zoom in like I said. Because it just goes really weird when I do. Look, see? Why is there water there? There's no water. It's very glitchy. So you could use it to like cheat and look through walls. Doesn't quite work like that though, unfortunately. Yeah, look, like, you can drive over trees. So cool. So there's a massive map. As you can see on the little radar there to the bottom right hand side. Oh, hello. Are you facing me? Oh. It's got a turret on the back of you as well. Anyone else around? Woo. This background music so cheerful as well. It's like, woo. let's drive into a tree. <laughs> oh yeah, casually knock down a tree. And yes, yeah, see, I told you you could knock down them. Don't listen, do you? Let's see if I can drive into them. Oh look at that. It's brilliant when the server doesn't respond, and then they just grow. Who? Who and where are you coming from? Huh. Oh yeah, I forgot about planes. I'm going to request a plane. So you can in fact request a plane. And now I've got a plane shooting me. Oh, there we go. Yep, ammunition load exploded. I get killed by someone else? Whoa! The range on these tanks is mad! Well, I don't think it's going to give me the option for a plane, is it? No. So, there we go. Let's return back to the hangar. So, guys, let me know your thoughts on this. Like, if you want to see me play the simulator and the realistic battles, then please be sure to leave a comment and let me know. Also, remember to follow my Twitter because I've got that giveaway going. It finishes on Wednesday the 9th of this month, March. We're in now, just have to remember then, yes. And the giveaway is for a random game. Literally, I'm going to be posting a Steam key to the winner 
and the details are on my Twitter right now. So they're pinned at the top of Twitter. Just check out my Twitter. The link for my Twitter is in the description down below for the giveaway. Not for the giveaway, but for Twitter. But it's pinned at the top of Twitter, so just check it out. Make sure that you subscribe to me. Make sure you follow my Facebook page as well. It's all, all the links in the description down below as well. So I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Hey, 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 hey.